85-year-old farmer Jinichi Abe is watching his rice fields return to productivity for the first time since 2011, when the Fukushima disaster covered the area with radiation. The rice grown here has been deemed unsuitable for consumption due to health worries, but now he has a steady buyer again. Not to grow rice for eating, but to turn it into low carbon plastic. Abe's town of Nami is still struggling to recover from the 2011 disaster when a tsunami triggered a meltdown at the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant. Parts of Nami lie only two and a half miles from the plant, and some 80% of the town's land currently remains off limits. Today, less than 2,000 people live in the town, compared with 21,000 before the disaster. But November 2022 was a turning point. A company based in Tokyo called Biomass Resin opened a factory in Nami. Here, rice is combined with small plastic beads, heated and kneaded, before it's extruded into thin rods that are cooled and cut into tiny brown pellets. The pellets, which are either 50% or 70% rice, are then sent to companies which manufacture plastic goods. All overseen by Biomass Resin President Takemitsu Imatsu. The raw materials are reborn as low carbon plastic cutlery and takeout containers used by major firms across Japan. They're used in chain restaurants, souvenirs sold at one of Japan's largest airports, and most recently in shopping bags at a BMW pop up showroom in Tokyo. While the plastic isn't biodegradable, Using rice cuts down on petroleum products, and growing more rice in Nami also reduces overall atmospheric CO2. Experts said additional testing has found no rice registering above strict radioactive limits, meaning the plastic is also fine too. For the town of Nami, the revival of industry is vital. Since 2017, eight companies have come in, including a concrete plant, aquaculture, and an EV battery recycler, generating about 200 jobs. Discussions are underway with others, and research institutes may bring more people still. Biomass Resin employs 10 people in NAMI and hopes to expand. It currently uses only about 55 tons of NAMI rice, the rest of the 1,700 tons needed are mainly from elsewhere in Fukushima. But it will be buying more next year from Abe and his cooperative, grown on these freshly cleared fields.